Having temporarily ceded first place in Ligue 1 to Paris Saint-Germain, Marseille travelled to bottom place Troyes on Sunday, looking to restore their three-point lead at the top of the table. After eight games, Troyes are the only team in Ligue 1 without a win this season. There was an early blow for the visitors as André-Pierre Gignac, their top goalscorer in this campaign so far, was forced off with a foot injury after only 18 minutes. Marseille still created the better chances going forward, with Mathieu Valbuena slipping a neat ball through to Morgan Malfitano, whose shot was well saved by Johan Tua. A powerful strike from Malfitano and Mathieu Sonia getting away with this miss hit clearance. Goalless at the break then, with Tua holding firm into the second half. And Mathieu Valbuena a free kick in the 48th minute forced another good save from Turin. Valbuena strike looping nicely over the wall but Turin anticipating it well. The host came close to taking a surprise lead shortly afterwards. A Stefan Derby on corner was headed onto the bar by Benjamin Neve and Marcus's acrobatic follow-up effort sailed wide. A minute later at the other end, there was an incredible miss from Loïc Rémy after a fine cross-in from André Ayou. Rémy completely misjudging his header and the ball bouncing out of play. There was more drama to come in the 89th minute. When Marseille failed to clear another dangerous corner from Darbion, Nive picked up the loose ball and rifled it past Steve Mandanda. A remarkable denouement with Mandanda parrying Marcus's header but failing to get the ball away. 35-year-old Nivet thrashing home. Elie Ball, understandably frustrated. Remy thought he had rescued a point for Marseille a minute later. But as the replay shows, it was clearly offside. One nil at full time then. Twice first victory of the season, which takes them off the bottom of League One, while at the other end, PSG remain top of the table on goal difference.